Hey guys, Kaji Bros here, and today I'm going to be do doing another toy review. Today's review is going to be on none other than King Kong. Now, everybody, if you're a diehard King Kong fan, you probably already know his history. Well, it's pretty long, so I'll only be explaining this one. This one comes from the uh, 2005 remake of the original film. So, what happens is a group of explorers come, come, come to Skull Island, and, and, and Kong at, attacks, attacks them, and, and he also fights off a whole bunch of dinosaurs, and, and then he's taken back, back, back to New York City, and, and they make a show about him, and he he breaks loose and and climbs the Empire State Building and then and then he and then he shot down and it's pretty much all there is to it. Right. Anyways, let's go on to detail. Now, as you can see, detail on this figure looks pretty nice. I mean, I mean, his teeth look really nice. You can even see his tongue and. And the roof of his mouth, and, uh, uh, well, and, uh, I don't know if you can see, but his eyes are painted as well. Well, and he's got a lot of scars on him. Um, I mean, on his legs, on his back, on, on his arms. Look at that big old monkey ass. Shake, shake. <laughs> oh, and... He has a, a, an action feature. Well, as you can see, his his arms are, are like this. See this button on his back? You push it and... Well, he smashes. It's pretty simple, actually. See? If you want this one to smash, you do that. If you want this one to smash, you do that. Okay, now it's on to articulation. His head moves 360. See? His elbows move in and out. Both of them do that. His his wrists move all the way around. And and his fingers can move too. I found that that to be pretty funky when I got him. His legs can move in and out too. And he can bend at the knees. Pretty cool. Now on to size comparisons. Anyways, it's time for for uh, his probably number one foe. Here is Godzilla. Hmm. Pretty nice. He's. I mean. I mean, I think Godzilla might be a little bigger, but I think this works. Works. And, uh, that's pretty much all there is to it. And finally, Lee Rarity. Um, I bought the, I bought the, this figure for Christmas uh, a few years ago, so... It, the, this figure was, was released back in, back in 2005, so it may be a little on the rare side. If you pick it up, up good for you. So, uh, that's pretty much all I have to say. Hey, history, good. Detail, really nice. Articulation, good. Uh, good. Action feature, nice. Size comparison, good. And rarity, if you pick up this guy, good for you. And this is Kaiju Bros, signing out.